हाय हेलो नमस्ते आदाब हाउ आर यू ऑल वेलकम बैक हेलो ऑल वेलकम बैक टुडे इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन यू सम इंटरेस्टिंग थिंग्स एंड फैक्ट्स दैट हैड हैपेंड अराउंड द वर्ल्ड सो लेट्स गेट started Do you know the world's biggest cricket bat is in Hyderabad Telangana state and do you know who is the inventor of sanitary pads and do you know there is a Guinness record for making your sandwich Don't worry I'm going to explain you in details not only about this but also some other interesting things in this video So don't forget to watch till end. Let us know your views on this video in the comment section down below. If you like the video, share with your friends so that more people will come to know about our channel. Hit the like button, subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to get notified whenever we upload new videos. Let's get into the video. Hey all, this is RK. Welcome to my channel. Do you know about the world's biggest cricket bat? World's biggest cricket bat, which is 56.1 feet long and weighs about 9000 kg, is made of poplar wood. And it took almost a month to make it. This bat is gifted by Beverage Company, Pernod Ricard India Private Limited to Government of Telangana. This bat is certified by Guinness World Records and was unveiled in Hyderabad by former Indian captain Mohammad Azharuddin. And this bat is made to convey best wishes to Indian cricket team for ICC World Cup that had happened in Dubai in 2020. Why not one doesn't love a sandwich? What is your favorite type of sandwich? Don't forget to comment down below. Making sandwich a mouthful size is not hard but think big think of making sandwich bigger than that earth sandwich yeah you heard it right earth sandwich not in terms of size but with the earth as filling two men one from new zealand and the other from spain created sandwich who are more than 20000 kilometers apart It is made by placing bread slices on precise points one on either side of the planet at same time. Etienne Naude from Auckland precisely with the other person he had found in south of Spain using longitude and latitude tool called tunnel to the other side of earth to find exact opposite point. And his volunteer from opposite side in south of Spain Angel Sierra 34 years old chef to show how people can work together across the globe Etienne Naude made specially decorated white bread onto 20 slices of bread and used one slice to mark his exact spot in New Zealand and on the other side Angel Sierra used nine slices to make sure that he covered the exact spot Naude used Reddit application to find his partner companion after trying in southern spain using his friends and family contacts etienne naude posted in his social media page with a slice of bread with a small new zealand flag poked into the ground in one panel and in the other side his spanish counterparts selfies with nine slices of bread covering location but the idea of making a sandwich is widely credited to american artist g frank successfully in 2006 tried the trick in Spain using baguettes with his friend from New Zealand Bill Ray Harris Bill Ray Harris a homeless man who lived on a street corner in Kansas City but one day his life has changed making him no longer homeless as his good deed 
went viral and gained national attention in 2013. If we go into the story in details, when Sarah, while passing Harris, dropped some change into his cup, but without knowing, accidentally she dropped her engagement ring in his cup. At first, Harris thought of selling the ring for four thousand dollars, but he couldn't go through with it. When Sarah came back after two days, he gave it back to her as a way to say thank you. Sarah and her husband Bill Crazy started a fund campaign to raise money for Harris and to help him back to get his life on track. They set up a goal for thousand dollars, but the fund raised far more than any of them expected in three months because people have donated more than one ninety thousand dollars. After the funds, Harris got his life back and bought a car, and even he put money on a house. Not only this, something even more vulnerable happened for Harris. After he appeared on a TV show, Today, an American talk show, his family members who had not been able to find him for 16 years were able to track him down. He said in an interview, "This is what they called the American dream." I want to thank all the people that helped me out and I want them to see where their efforts, blessings and kindness is going. Don't forget to give a like to this couple for this great gesture. Before going further, a small request from you all. If you are a new member, don't forget to click the subscribe button. And if you are already a subscriber, don't forget to like and share this information with your friends. Heliang Jiang, Hand Cannon 1288. Gunpowder was invented in China early 9th centuries. Taoist alchemical book Jangam Miadao Yaluwei from mid 800s contains a passage that mentions use of gunpowder. By 12th century, evidences shows that Song Dynasty's forces were fighting battles with gunpowder weapons such as fire lances, grenades, metal bombats. Outside of archaeological findings, appearance of cannons may suggest that it was invented early 12th century. The earliest extant hand cannon and world's oldest running firearm is Helong Jiang, hand cannon or handgun. According to Yuan Shi, a text that documents history of Yuan dynasty, a Jurchen commander led a group of soldiers carrying hand cannons into a military camp in 1288. These hand cannons were light enough that could be carried on backs of Yuan dynasty soldiers. Dating this gun is based on battles happened in 1287 to 1288 AD. It is a bronze hand cannon said to be world's oldest confirmed surviving firearm excavated during 1970s in Banla Chengji in Heliongjiang province Sena alongside with other bronze arty crafts like bronze vase, cooking pan, mirror etc. were made in style of Jurchen Jin dynasty 12 to 13th century. Even though earliest textual reference to a hand cannon dated 1230 but oldest surviving hand cannon is 1288 occurred in mid 13th century. This Heliangjong hand cannon is at museum in Harbin, China, Heliongjiang Provincial Museum. Nevertheless, archaeologists have discovered hundreds of surviving metal cannons and hand cannons in China from 13th to 14th century. An inspiring story of a doctor who gave birth and helped other women to give birth. A particularly inspiring birth story a pregnant doctor delivered a baby moments before being succeed in pursuing her delivery, proving that some doctors are never truly off the clock. A woman doctor who showed what professionalism and compassion when she passed her delivery to help another woman in hospital to deliver her child safely. 
Amanda Hess, a Kentucky-based doctor, was in the hospital to give birth to her second child. When she heard labor screams from another mother and couldn't resist herself from jumping into action as the patient was in distress and needed immediate attention. The woman leading to last minute complications, wailing in pain and the on-call doctor is not yet around. Amanda Hess walked to fellow patient's room and helped her in giving birth to a healthy baby. And later she returned to her room and got back into her hospital bed and gave her own healthy baby girl. That's all for today. I hope you all like the video. Don't forget to like the video, share with your friends and subscribe to my channel and don't forget to leave your comment down below. Thank you. Thanks. Love you forever.